Hello everyone and welcome for a new series of StarCraft 2. Now, it's not exactly StarCraft 2 because today we are going to be starting a whole new series about StarCraft 1 campaign, but essentially it's in the StarCraft 2 engine. Uh, we are using a mod that's called StarCraft Mass Recall and this mod allows you to play StarCraft 1 campaign in the StarCraft 2 engine. And what that means is that, for example, in StarCraft 1, you are only able to select 12 units at a given time, but StarCraft 2 you can select pretty much every unit on the map with uh, with one button. Uh, other thing is that you in StarCraft 1 you can only hotkey one building to uh, to one hotkey, and in StarCraft 2 you can hotkey multiple buildings. So overall, it makes the control of the the army and the units management uh, and whatnot uh, a little more easier than StarCraft 1. And the graphically looking, uh, I think it should look prettier than StarCraft 1. So we are going to be starting a whole new series uh, dedicated for this playthrough. We are going to go through the Broodware campaign and the original campaign. And after these two series fend off, uh, we are going to start uh, a series for the StarCraft 2 campaign. Uh, Winds of Liberty and Hordes of the Swarm and Legacy of the Void. And eventually Nova Covered Ops. So stay tuned for that. Now, if you are interested in this uh, mod and how to install it, uh, I'll leave a link to the video uh, that uh, will take you through the progress of installing the mod and playing it yourself. Now, without further ado, let's get starting with the first episode of the campaign of StarCraft 1. We have the six campaigns here, the Rebel Yell and the Overmind, the Zerg campaign and the Fall, the third campaign of StarCraft Original, and then the Stand and Ironfest and Queen of Blades, the three campaigns for the uh, uh, Brood War expansion. So uh, I'm going to go through the option quickly. So we have the difficulty. Uh, of course, we're going to make this on the hardest difficulty possible. And we, we want the cinematics, of course. So in the audio section, we can use between the, uh, the StarCraft 1 uh, voices and the StarCraft 2 voices. So there are some... Uh, Resets here, but I think we are going to make it all Brood War, so that we so that we get the feeling of uh, the Brood War campaign. So let's get starting with the Rebel Yell campaign. High Orbit Confederate Border Colony Chao Sara. Can't see you think, Jim. Well, hold on. I swear, it's always some damn thing. Wait, got it. Ah, oh, hell, this thing ain't gonna hold. Shut up. Damn, you're ugly. You girl strapped in nice and tight now. Hatter, your mama. <laughs> That's a good one, man. For me out there, Joey Ray. We got terror for sure. I don't know about the risk. We got a big old buttload of floating debris out here. We hit painter this time for sure. Explain to me how we're gonna get all this home. I'm detached and moving toward the derelict spacecraft. Damn it, Jim. Video's out again. Well, quit picking at it. I ain't picking at it, damn it. I'm out here with a hitch of my gay up in here and there. I'm in your deck. 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 I'm in your deck.
Wow. The Blizzard cinematics are actually quite impressing. So first mission is Boot Camp, Office of the Colonial Magistrate Marsara Colony. So as you can see we are mainly in the uh, engine of StarCraft 2 but we are uh, simply uh, playing the StarCraft 1 campaign. So Terran campaign Rebel Yell in the decade since the end of the, the Gold Wars, the oppressive Terran Confederacy has stood unchallenged in its supremacy over colonized space. All of that changed four days when uh, a large alien fleet emerged from warp space and laid waste to the unsuspecting confed confederate colony of Chao Sara. The confederacy, fearing that this uh, that the alien fleet's next target will be the colony of Mars Sara, has sent you to intervene acting as magistrate you are to safeguard the colonists and keep their state of panic from escalating any further. So let's continue. Welcome to Marsara, Magistrate. The equipment demonstration you requested is prepared and may be initiated at your convenience. Simply select Start to begin the demonstration. You may skip the demonstration by selecting Skip Tutorial. So this is the basic tutorial of the game. I think uh, knowing the basics of the game already, uh, we can uh, we can already skip Whenever through the tutorial. Whenever you feel you are ready, you may select Start. We can simply skip through the tutorial because it's, you know, kind of just learning you how to play the game. So the first actual mission is Wasteland, Office of the Colonial Magistrate on Marsara Colony. Now the, the first time I played StarCraft 1 campaign was uh, quite some time already. Was, was since quite some time already so I don't exactly remember how the mission goes and all these things so we'll see how it goes Adjutant online Good evening magistrate I'll fill you in on what's been happening Confederate traffic has increased substantially within the system due to the recent protoss destruction of the Chao Sara colony the Confederates have tightened security on all outlying systems, and it's likely that this colony will be locked down as well. An encrypted Confederate transmission came for you while you were at dinner. Replaying transmission. Greetings, Magistrate. I'm General Edmund Duke of the Confederate Security Forces Alpha Squadron. The Confederacy has quarantined this entire planet, and we'll proceed with a lockdown within 48 hours. You are to relocate your core colonists to the outlying wastelands. Now I know there won't be any problems with these new arrangements. Transmission ended. I have contacted the local marshal James Rayner. Rayner has agreed to meet your personnel en route and escort them to the new wasteland site. So first mission objectives is to find Raynor and build a barracks and train 10 marines. So let's get into it. The graphics of the original uh, 
cinematics is quite old but I think they are still giving us the, uh, the feel of the old game and uh, actually in higher graphics in StarCraft 2. So our first mission Our first mission, of course, is to find Raynor and to build a Parex and 10 Marines. I... Howdy, boys. I'm Jim Raynor. Marshal these parts. Okay, so we find Raynor. And we are ready to go towards our Let's move. base down here, but I think we are getting quite some resistance here. This should be good. Now we can start mining, of course, and producing more SCVs as we get the money for it. Go ahead, Commander. Sounds fun. This is Jimmy. Anytime you're ready. Raider here. So we need to start building our Parex and uh, it is the same cost as the Starcraft 2 so we need to harvest uh, 150 minerals so I think this is uh, all the SCVs that we are going to need to for now and we are going to start doing some exploration while we uh, wait for the money to accumulate Wow the Zerg here is quite aggressive against us. Sounds fun. So I go think ahead, I'm Commander. going to keep the Marines here and go out with Raynor only. Anytime you're ready. Oh yeah. Right on. Oh yeah. We can get another barracks. This is Jimmy. While we wait. Right on. And we can see here some Zerglings. Uh, I can put uh Spider mine here this and here, good. and call them to action. Right on. Go ahead, Commander. This should be good. Rainer. Now we have got the Parex. Infantry units such as Marines can be trained at this facility. Thank you. Right on. This should be good. So I think we can't take any more damage right to Raynor. You're ready. So we'll try our best to fun? keep him alive for the entirety of the game. We managed to stay alive for a little bit more. And we are creating the marines now. Vespine geyser required for placement. This should be good. And we have nine of the ten marines, and that's it for this mission. So I think we have successfully delivered uh, the colonists to the wasteland and they are being transported now so with that we have succeeded to finish the first uh, mission of the uh, starcraft uh, rebel yell campaign uh, the wasteland we have a survival rate of 100 percent here <laughs> And that's already good. If you like this video, please give it a like. And if you want to see the upcoming missions, make sure to subscribe so you'll get a notification as soon as I upload the video. Uh, thank you everyone for watching. Have a nice day and good luck. Have fun everyone.